Good morning, Darby. How are you? Good morning. I'm great. Are you uh, tired of all the interviews you've had today? <laughs> Guess what? You're my last one. So, so wow. we, we can celebrate. So anything goes at this <laughs> anything point. Oh, no, 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 no. We'll talk about lock and key. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Let's not talk about our years together in show business coming up in vaudeville. All of that. Right. Um, first of all, I, I really do want to congratulate you on uh, Scandal. Thank well, uh, you. you. Know, I was going through heart surgery and discovered Scandal, and you basically saved my life. Oh, I love to hear stories like that. That's so great. I feel so, I'm grateful and I feel so lucky to have been a part of that show. Um, and I, lo I just love to hear that. Abby Whelan is one of those great characters that just come <laughs> along once in a while. And, That's right. She, and, uh, she speaks her mind, I'm doesn't so she? I'm so glad. Yeah. Uh, lock and key. <laughs> Let's talk about uh, that now. Since, yes. Uh, Lock Since and that's key. why we're here. That's right. Lock and Key. It's a, my new series that uh, just dropped on Netflix today. You can binge uh, all 10 episodes of the first season. Lock and Key is based on the best-selling graphic novels written by Joe Hill. He's Stephen King's son. He's got a, a prolific career of his own. And he wrote these comic books. And they have a giant fan base already. And um, this TV show is kind of like a Stranger Things meets Harry Potter, a little bit of Goonies maybe, um, Haunting of Hill House. So it's like all of those nostalgic, like all of those shows that you like, this is one of those shows. It's terrifyingly fun. Ter that's right, terrifyingly fun, exactly. Um, and, and, you know, coming into something that's already got a huge fan base like this, I mean, yeah. is there a little bit of trepidation on your part to get it right? Uh, that is always a concern of an actor's. I have to say, in this process, particularly with this project, Joe Hill, who's the author of the comic books, and Gabriel Rodriguez, who's the illustrator, they have been nothing but supportive. They came to set a couple of times. They've watched the episodes, and they've been incredibly complimentary of our, our work. And my character in particular, I, I'm very, very different than the Nina Locke in the comic books, the Nina Locke in the Netflix show. She's quite different, and they ha have been great and supportive. And so that helps you feel like, okay, I can relax and, and just make sure I tell a good story. Now, now, one of the characters in, in, in the series is the house itself. Yes. Um, yes, Key House. Yeah, t tell me a little bit about s sure. stepping onto that set. Yeah, well, uh, Key House in the show is the ancestral home in which the dad, he gets murdered in the pilot. So it's, it's and I play the mom, and, we, and I take these three children back to their dad's home ancestral home and it's called key house and it's this giant it looks like a like a hogwarts uh, school in harry potter it's this giant giant mansion it's it's decades old it's run down and it's full of magic it has these magic keys magical keys in the house that whisper to the kids and as they whisper and sing to the kids the kids find them they discover them and then they discover that each key has its own set of magic its own powers and so yeah, this set, they spared no expense. Netflix opened their purse strings for us, and the production design is incredible. My hat really goes off to that team. And um, so as an actor, it was like pretty jaw-dropping when we walked on set. In the pilot, you see our family walking through this key house, and that was the first time that we actually did get to see it. So there's a little bit of this, oh my gosh, as we're, and it's, it's real. <laughs> it's pretty incredible. It sounds like, you know, fr from beginning to, to, to the end of this first season, you guys have had a ball doing the show. We have. I love this cast. The kids who play my children on the show, Connor Jessup, Amelia Jones, Jackson Robert Scott, they're going to blow up from this and become huge stars. They're, they're just, they're charming. There's a lot of heart in the show. Even, I mean, the whole ensemble cast, you know, really, it, it has a lot of heart. I feel like that comes across on the show. Um, it's very well cast, and um, I, I just I just adore them, and I really I hope that people enjoy it as much as I enjoyed making it. 
Now, is there any any uh, hope of maybe you hopping behind the camera and doing a little directing? Well, that's always my hope. Um, I'm always ambitious in that way. We'll see. We're hoping to get a season two. So binge season one right now and let's make Netflix happy. Um, but yeah, that's always a, a pursuit of mine. I did direct uh, an episode of Scandal in the last season as well as the digital miniseries for the website and I had a ball doing it. So. So more to come. I've already green lighted season two. I just oh, you want have. you to know. I, I, oh, wow. I made a phone call. Okay. I just called. Where's the yeah, champagne? It, it's, <laughs> it's an incredible series. It's an incredible series, and it's so much fun. And it's it's like I said, it's it's terrifying. Yet there's humor in it. There's it's got something for everybody. <laughs> it really does. Thank you, Tony. Thanks for saying so. And listen, uh, I know that you're a Disney family. Your uncle was an animator for Disney, and yes. and your your next project is Star Girl. Yes, yes. My great uncle was an illustrator back in the day for Walt Disney, and so yes, I have a, a new movie coming out um, in March. I believe it's March thirteenth. Um, it streams on Disney Plus. So you know, I feel like I'm doing my great uncle solid there by getting involved with the, D the Disney family, and Star Girl. Yeah, Star Girl is also a special one. And when you do that one, I want to be there and uh, either on the junket or we'll talk on satellite like this. Let's do it. Because, you know, we, we have known each other for over 35 years, and it's, uh, <laughs> yeah. it's always nice to see you. Oh, thank you. Darby, th thank you so much, and congratulations on, on the new series, uh, Lock and Key. It's on Netflix. Binge it and, uh, and enjoy it. Thanks, Tony. Bye-bye. All right. Have a great day. Bye.